So this will be my final broadcast. Sober, not caring what people think about me. Just because I'm little, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, I've used drugs. I don't care. I can't do this anymore. You try and try to make it, but no, no, don't know where to turn. Everyone around you pushes you down, and the people that build you up build you up because they want something from you. So, honestly, there's really not anyone who actually gives a fuck out there. Except for what they can get or what they want. or The message of equality that we hear from Tegan and Sarah, it's a beautiful thing. But the truth is, in Texas, in America, here where I'm at, around Dallas, where my mom is, where all the people are, I have no one here that cares to make sure that I'm okay. When I talk to the law, they take me to jail because my mom has money and I don't. Even though what I'm doing is what's right and she's trying to make me look crazy. She wants to call institutions to institutionalize me, put me on medications because she says that I'm mentally challenged and that I need these things. I'm highly intelligent like Mozart. Yeah, I'm bipolar. I don't need medications for my bipolar. I need people to stop lashing out at me. I need people to stop treating me like I'm ignorant. I need people to stop treating me like I'm not worth anything. I need people to stop abusing me. Stop telling me I'm not big enough. Stop telling me I shouldn't be alive. Stop telling me that I'm a mistake. Stop beating me my whole life. Stop hurting me. I I didn't have good parents. If I had good parents, I guarantee you I'd have a great life and an and a education in music because that was my passion. I did it all through school. I mean, it sucks having somebody down you your whole life and not having your father there because he's in prison because he's an idiot and he is an Aryan brother now and all this stupid shit. And you know what? I'm German, Dutch, Irish, Welsh, and Italian. I'm highly intelligent. I know where I come from. I know who my people are. So what? They came to America. They shouldn't have fucking had me and then left me with my mother, someone who mentally and physically abused me my whole life because she wants me to be like her. I'm sorry. I won't be a whore. I'm sorry. I won't work at a strip club to give you my money to help you with my bills. I'm sorry I didn't keep my kids because when I came home from the strip club, which is the only thing you told me I could do, I gave up my kids because my cousin Amanda Shipman smoking a damn dope pipe in the room with my daughter. And yet every day you down me? You down me and tell me I'm the problem because I gave up my children to protect them from you? I'm not the problem. You're the problem. You need to grow up. That's what it is. You need to stop. You need to change. You need to realize that the world doesn't revolve around you and your pimping and your sins and everything that you want to promote in this world. This world is about love, God, unity, and equality. All the things that are good in this world. And I don't care about your, your selfish ways. I don't care about your wanting to do whatever you want to do because you want to. Like, you're just like Little Wayne. No offense. Just saying, Little Wayne, grow up, dude. You used to be a good person. What happened to you? I don't know. Like, just like Bieber, his songs used to be about love and good things, and now look at him, he's a little shit. Like, some people just need to grow up. Grow up. Grow up. Get some God in your life. Get some good in your life. Do whatever it is that's right in this world. And you know what's right? Not hurting people. Not downing people. Not treating people like shit. But getting your shit together and doing what's right. If you have a child in this world and you choose to beat it and push it down its whole life because you want it to be like you, maybe you should give that child up to someone who will love it and care and appreciate it because it's not right. If you choose to beat your child into submission, you break its spirit. When you break your child's spirit, that child is going to have mental disorders. Those disorders can go away. Not from medication, not from this, not from that, but, but doing what's right. Treating them right. All disorders that are diagnosed by doctors have causes. 
counseling and things like that. It doesn't need to be done. Those causes need to be fixed. Those hurt, broken people need to be held, need to be hugged, and need to be treated with the same respect as any other individual because I guarantee you if those things were done for those people, they wouldn't be half as angry as they are. They wouldn't be half upset as they are. And you know what is wrong in society nowadays? The way people think that are evil. If you're evil, try to find yourself. Try to find your soul. Try to find your heart. Take it back from whoever you sold it to and hold it tight. Because in the end of this eternal battle that is life, you're going somewhere. And I know you think where you're going is what's right. But let me tell you something about the devil. The devil was an angel at one point in time. He was the most beautiful, most sought after angel. He wanted to do God's job because he thought he could do it better. Because he was tired of looking down on earth and seeing all the pain. Now because of this, because he challenged God, God threw him out into the street, into hell. Let me just tell you something about the devil that is a little bit misinterpreted. There are two gods. One is the devil and one is God. The devil's just an angel, so really there's two heavens. Now truth is, you repeat your life over and over and over again on earth, purgatory, and you don't get to go to heaven if you continue to live in hell. Hell could all go away. The only way to make it go away is to stop doing what you're doing and become an angel. I'm saying this because this is probably the last thing I'm ever going to post. This is the last recording I'm going to make and I'm not crazy and I don't care who says I am. I can't take this world anymore. I can't take the abuse. I can't take the pain. I can't take feeling alone. So, I'll give up on my dreams, which is to make music and promote good. Because no one's ever going to stand up for me. I can't stand up for myself because I never had that hand to help me. There's too much pain in my heart and in my soul for me to keep wanting to move on. I don't need a medication. I don't need an institution. I need love. So I've never really had that. Bye.